Let's take a look here at attributes. So attributes are pieces of information that help identify individual users, such as names, email addresses, and phone numbers. Amazon Cognito assigns all users a set of standard attributes based on the OpenID Connect specification. So let's see things like address, birthday, uh, birth date, email, family name, uh, gender, given name. You get the idea. The one that's unique here is sub. So sub is a unique identifier. It's required and set by Cognito. Um, so that is something that is uh, required there. If these look familiar, it's because these are basically claims. This is what would show up uh, in your claim information in your JWT. Uh, now, does it show all of them? I'm not sure, but this is information that you would see in there. You can add up to 50 custom attributes to your user pool. You define your attribute schema at the time of creation. Um, uh, I wanna point out that you don't wanna put all of your data in here. This is just data that doesn't change often, that uh, will save you a trip to your database. But for the most part, you want to store as little as you can here and not rely on this as your main uh, uh, place for data, okay?